you also have, if I'm not mistaken, uh, a very unique system of interpreting and appraising the merits of restaurants based solely on the quality of their milkshakes. Is that correct? <laughs> <laughs> Gee, buzzer. I, I don't know where you got this information. It has to be, it has to be one of my good friends. But yeah, and I look. Big on top of my list when it comes to a restaurant. Um, I don't drink beer um, because of all the fines meetings we've had in the past. Um, those are really horrible. Um, so I can't drink beer slowly, so it has to be a down down, and I don't think that's a great restaurant drink. So my restaurant drink is a milkshake, and unfortunately, I'm quite, um, yeah, what's the less uh, aggressive word. Uh, I'm, I'm a very big critic when it comes to food. Like I like to get value when I pay for my food. So when the milkshake's not great, I do complain sometimes. And you know, the guys do give me a hard time about that. What, what sort of response do you get from the concierge on Maitre d' when you've ordered <laughs> your, uh, your lobster on a plate of seared salmon with some risotto and a double baked blue cheese souffle with an extra large strawberry milkshake? <laughs> Uh, much like that looks like. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going, very much that looks. So a smile, but a lot of confusion. <laughs> <laughs>